same problem, way too big, not enough to do. I don't feel like that has anything to do with the amount of modes and things you can play in 2K. I think that's all about the actual design of the city. It's way too damn big. There's not enough going on. There's no reason to actually play into it. Let, let me, let me, can y'all hear me? I'm driving right now. Y'all can hear me? Yeah, yeah, we can hear you. Yeah, we can hear that, And then they're not going to shrink, they're not going to shrink the fucking city. We all know this because that fucking ad space, they, they want their, 2K doesn't give a, I'm being honest, like, it's a big ass city. They don't care if you have to run around. They just want space to put ads. But when it's time just, to actually just, play the I mean, game, the park has yeah. to be a lot easier to move around. The park has to be a lot better. It has to feel better. To me, this is, and I'm, I'm not speaking for everyone. I'm just speaking for this is me. itself they gotta be smaller they have to be a little more condensed the designs I, gotta be a, better they have to feel better to walk around and run around there's no point in putting all these transportation items in the uh uh Whatever, you, like if you're in the park and you're trying to go from one court to another, you're either gonna use the shoes or the skateboard. Cause anything else either takes too long to pull out or uh, uh, takes too long to get out of, or you can't even have that it. shit. Have that shit glitchy anyway. Like I can't even fucking it's drive a the go kart. Like I, it's like I don't know. Like I feel, <laughs> I, I feel retarded driving that shit because I, I fucking crashed into everything. There's a lot so, that goes on. Like, there's a lot that goes I'm, on. And, and, and I still want to ask, like, ask Gio at least, because I, I understand what you're saying. But like, uh, what do you mean by too many modes? Like, like I still don't really. Like I'm talking about that, in the like, city, like, the, like the, they just need to keep it park rec pro am. That's it. That's it. Why though? Oh, hold on, hold on. You're not gonna leave the stage out. That's the damn story. <laughs> oh, and the stage. My fault. And the stage. I'm not. Bro, yeah, I don't sweat my, somebody, I don't sweat my balls off like I used to. The I know, I know plenty of people who enjoy the theater. Then they need... you, know what, you, know what, you know what, you know what, though? You know what, though? I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm gonna keep it a stack. He got a point. And you know why he got a point? And I didn't think about this, though. Because the reason why I'm gonna say he got a point is because you're right. Don't get me wrong. The the arcade is the arcade is good for people. For us at the arcade, the, um, what, what's it called again? I forgot. The theater? Yeah, the theater is good. The theater is good for people. We know, we know what you mean. <laughs> nah, the theater, yeah, the theater is good for people that I'm driving. That's why I'm freaking crazy. Um, the theater is good for people who basically, like, you don't have the one to play with. But then if you take the theater away, right, you add more people into the park. Well, why? Well, I feel like... You're going to have to make motherfuckers like run around logic. and jump on the spot. They're not going to be able to like play unless they walk like in the record random. Logic. If your if your solution to making but, people but play I'm a saying, game mode is removing a game mode, that, that what, I, what I'm saying, problem. Sax, what I'm sa listen, what I'm saying is motherfuckers are complaining about not getting games in the park. I don't know how many fucking people play in theater. I haven't played two cases since fucking lot. February, but I that might be theater. part of the reason. Will that not be part well, of the yeah, reason? Yeah, of course, of course it is. Of course it's part of the reason people don't get games in the park. Why would I as a two K? Power's player, laughing. Power, what's so I, funny, I bro? Lie, Cause I ain't gonna lie, what y'all saying is kind of it's kind of bogus. It's a little bogus. Cause like, just hear me out, right? If you have a game mode that people are already before the other game mode existed, people are already having a hard time getting games. You add a game mode to where people can get games. Why would you then remove that game mode just so other people can play the game mode that's already dwindling? It doesn't make sense. It's 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 very backwards logic. Because two two K is adding shit on and not fixing the shit that needs to be fixed. But you guys just told them to remove something instead of fixing something. 
though. The, the, fix, the fix is the removing fix, it, though. The fix that's, is that's removing it. That doesn't <laughs> actually. Okay, but see, what does that fix? What does that fix? It fixes, about? It fixes Joe Bob from running to the theater to play with his to play with randoms to jump on the randoms court in the park. But if he doesn't want to wait for a game or wait for teammates to hop on, why should he? You know, you have a like, point. But, you know? <laughs> but, but I'm saying. Like, if Exactly. That's more people to play. That's what I was saying. That's more people to play. So yeah, I get that. that. That's what I. That's what I'm. Where people play park. Why does it matter? Yeah. Thank you. Great because, question. Because, because, because where, where are motherfuckers just complaining about getting games? That, but that's, that's the problem. You don't get games because it's not people in park. We get games because yeah. we know because of the server size, how many courts there are, and. I don't want people in the home, server in that match. Like, That's why you can go back to an old game, and people do this every year. They go back to a two-year-old game. The servers are so lit right now. No, they're not. There's one server, and everybody's in that server, <laughs> and now they're getting games. <laughs> so it doesn't really matter how many people are playing it. It just matters that the people in that server are matching the amount of courts in there. If you have yeah. 50 people in the park and there's 30 courts, of course you're not going to be getting games. You know what I mean? So. That's what that's about. It doesn't really matter I, if you print more people if they're not matching the correct amount of people to the correct I just course. feel like it's very it's very odd. It's an odd decision to remove something so that to force other people to play a game on that they don't want to play. If people yeah, want the whole to play part, thing is like, they will yeah. play it. But clearly a lot of people mm -hmm. don't really want to play it. It's not as fun as we make it out to be. Nobody wants to wait for a game. Nobody wants to wait for a game to finish. Nobody wants to be ran from. Nobody wants to be a random. I like playing like, park. No, I, I, I just wanted to I say that I like playing park. I watched my dad play two That's what that, that's night what night I'm night. saying. Like I, I played bro. I played two cases fifteen, bro. I don't like I like the, I fuck with the park, bro. That's I, I like think people like park, park, and I think people like park too. So why don't you push so why don't you push for a better park system? Why why does something have to be taken away for you to enjoy your game mode that you like? That's my I wouldn't question. say I would I wouldn't say I would enjoy it. I'm just like I'm just making a suggestion it might get more motherfuckers running around the park. It's a game mode that a lot of people like. But that that's what I'm saying. It fixes the that problem. Actually, that doesn't fix anything. You just get more people running around in a game mode that they didn't want to play to begin to. They're forced to play it. You're backtracking. I, I'm just, not your backtracking. I'm, your 2K is backtracking. If they did that, that'd be a step backwards. I will say I'm just, that I'm like a problem with you, though. And I think that problem is there's a lot of events that people don't want to play or nobody plays. Yeah. Like, I see them do, like, level 40 only like certain events that there's like nobody in you know what i mean so actually community played events and they say that Thanks. some of them are you know but they they do these random events where there's really no interest in there because you're just taking up a spot for something nobody really wants to play so i don't have a problem with theater i just feel like the stuff in there needs to be stuff that people want facts uh, the theater needs to be better we need a 24 7. hey yo can y'all hear me what up, Pod? Yeah, we are. Yo, I've been, I've been yeah, yeah. talking talk for me. <laughs> hey, yo, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna uh, ask the room a question real quick, right? Does that yeah. Remember the feeling of 2K16 and 2K17? 16 was better. What do you mean the feeling? Of course. Yeah. What do you mean by that? The, the, the feeling of like being able to get games, being able to actually have fun on the game, wanting to be on the game. Do y'all, y'all remember that, right? We seen the yeah. that earlier. All right, so boom. Y'all know back in those older games, we actually loaded only into parks. We we didn't have the option to spawn nine different places. The block didn't exist. And that's the real reason why everything is the way it is. Because what happens is if you ever load into the block when you first turn the game on, it's at least 30 people in the block. Every yeah, there is. And they just standing there and doing nothing. Right, they just stand in there. Now, that used to be the park back in 16 and 17. Now, also, do you remember the feeling where it was actually people on the on the Got Next waiting? Where it was a, a trove of people, like 20 people waiting to play their favorite content creator and all of that. The reason why a lot of that stuff, that, God damn, boy, you're going, you're going through hell. 
Oh. I, I will oh, say, my, that my, still my, happens, my, King. Like, there's, there's still a trouble people waiting, but on current gen. That shit doesn't right. happen on that Now, now this, yeah. is what I'm, this is what I'm saying. For the city part, for next gen, the yeah. reason why that doesn't happen is because now some content creators are even scared to have an adder in the park because they don't want to get banned. As well as, if you do do that, some people might even report. Okay, everybody. Uh, if you guys see it from this tweet here, I, yeah, I can see it. I was just in that twist, but I actually did want to talk, talk to these guys for YouTube. You know, I'm about to call this shoot every once. X. Power DF. You know, y'all know pretty much all those guys were there. Pretty much all those guys were in, were in that, uh, in that little, little Twitter space. You guys know I did record that for a little minute. But also, I want to give you guys a little, little here about the adrenaline ball boost that, um, it was, I'm, I'm probably going to title it, um, adrenaline ball boost come back 2K24 discussion or whatever. I'm not sure what I'm going to call it, but. Anyways, y'all can see here, um, I want you guys to listen to, um, Double H. He has made two little voice videos about the Julian Ball Boost, so we're gonna go right ahead and, uh, see about that. And I'm gonna be quiet. So, yeah, pay, try to pay attention to the best way y'all can, and here we go. I wanted... I wanted to give my opinion on adrenaline bars potentially returning to 2K24. So if you are listening to this and agree with what I'm saying, at Baluba in the comments, like this tweet, retweet this tweet. And if you are Baluba listening to this, just hear me out. Now, I heard that early in the 2K uh, Rookie 1 event, there were some creators saying that the adrenaline bars were back after testing the game early. And they also said that they told you that it should be reverted and that the community doesn't like this. At least most of the community doesn't like it. And I agree with what that person was saying. So let me explain why I also think adrenaline bars should be gone for 2K24. Now, before anyone just says, oh, you're just ass, that's why you think that. No, this is just my genuine opinion on the game. I have a 90 plus win percent every year. I play stage, I play pro I play park, I play rec, I play ones, I play twos, I play threes, I play every mode you can think of. Also, there are some people that think adrenaline bars just need to be adjusted. In my opinion, I disagree with that. I think at the end of the day, adrenaline bars are going to limitate uh, players. And I don't think those limitations should occur like they are with adrenaline bars. So the reasons that adrenaline bars were added to the game were left writing isn't realistic and people wanted uh, people to play more realistic, number one. And number two, they wanted people to stop left writing. And number three, they wanted, you know, to tone down people ball hogging and dribbling out the shot clock. Now, in my opinion, it actually didn't do any of these things. It did not stop unrealistic gameplay nor promote realistic gameplay. If anything, adrenaline hurts the game more than it actually keeps people from exploiting the game. It actually even promotes less realistic gameplay. If any moment, if anyone is down to one adrenaline bar, guess what they're gonna do? They're gonna stop and go and try to rim run, which eventually leads to people having repetitive gameplay where that's all they're doing is spamming that stop and go move and literally just spamming the limitless takeoff and the quick drops. And yes, a game to 21 where you are jumping from the free throw line 11 times is just not realistic at all if you have an 85 three-pointer and nine times out of the 10 you are driving to the basket that is just not realistic there is a clear problem and there's nothing wrong with attacking the basket but if your player has all these attributes like i said 85 plus three and that's what you're doing is attacking the rim nine out of ten times because you're limited on your jewel moves then yes that's not a good thing not only that this this adrenaline bars is just not realistic any nba player college player hey it's the second one High school player even middle school player is not on their hands and knees after three drool moves so why is it like that in the video game these limitations just encourage players to be less creative with their moves encourage players to not even want to practice advanced drill moves and encourage players to mo mostly move vertically forcing them to rim run and then number two it did not stop left writing so the players that were good at the game that left righted before can still left right and get their three. You see it in 2K3 games all the time. And then the average or below average players that used to left right literally just spam that stop and go move until, they, until they're open or until they have a wide open limitless takeoff dunk. And number three, it did not stop ball hogs. So anyone complaining about people dribbling up the shot clock for 24 seconds, let's be honest. People are, if you go into the wreck with randoms, right? People are still going to ball hog. All it is is just their possession is going to last a little less longer, and they're just going to take a bad shot. I know all rec randoms know that's true. And not only that, if you do have teammates, just pick teammates that aren't going to dribble out the shot clock. But if you don't have teammates, it's literally the same thing that's happening. They're still ball hogging. So it didn't fix any of these issues that we thought it was going to fix. And it also limited all of the 2K fans 
that love the dribbling systems in the old 2Ks that was advanced and unrealistic but fun. So why don't we go back to that unique, unrealistic, creative dribbling to separate people from their play styles when it comes to dribbling. And at the end of the day, those were the 2Ks that was everyone's favorite 2Ks where you had that kind of dribbling system. So why not go back to that? I don't know. That's just my opinion, my thoughts on adrenaline bars. I do not think they should be in 2K24. But let me know your thoughts. Obviously, people have different opinions. People disagree. And that's, you know, that's that. But I feel like most of the community does not want this in the game, whether they are a dribbler or not. So, yeah, you guys heard it from uh, none other than Double H. Uh, yeah, Double H. Yeah. So, what do you so what do you guys think about your young boot while it's coming back to the Bitcoin 4? So, yeah. Um, so, what do you guys think, think of uh, Double H and how you speak it on EBA 2K24 for about, about that? And also the Twitter space that I was going to have for a few minutes, too. So, yeah, y'all. Um, as always, y'all be sure to like, comment, subscribe. I will see all y'all in the next video. I'm out, y'all. Peace.